pay you guys. Dom's Reviews here with a 2017 BMW X5. Beautiful color. It looks like the previous owner may have wrapped it, but it looks beautiful. Comes standard with the smart key access system. Beautiful key fob. It feels, it feels nice. It has a nice feeling to it. It also has the M Sport lines here on the key fob. Unlock, lock, trunk release, and panic. So to unlock the car, you just have to keep the key fob in your pocket. This red portion here locks the door. To unlock the door, you just put your hand behind and the sensor catches your hand. and unlock switches are on the door as well as your your trunk release your mirror adjustments and this switches from left mirror to right mirror this button here actually closes the mirror push it again you just reopen them and automatic up and down on all four windows as well as the window lock switch so to start the car Put your foot on the brake and hit the engine start button here. does have heated and cooled seats these buttons here control how much air pressure you want coming out this is your defrog defroster for the front windshield your max AC button like and this turns up and down the fan speed also this here controls which way you want the air to come out if you want it to come out by your legs by your head anything like that this button here syncs both climate controls together because you can change if the passenger wants it hot and the driver wants it cold, you can change it like that. This here is for your CDs. Volume controls here. Hazards. Beautiful steering wheel. And sport logo here. There's so much that you can do with this car, honestly. It's a beautiful car. Pedal shifters, minus, as well as your plus here. Here's your windshield wiper stock. Has automatic windshield wipers also. And here is your left and right turn signal as well as your lights. Your high beams. It does have a heated steering wheel. You just press that button in here and it starts to light up orange and it tells you steering wheel activated. 
and it is tilt and telescoping steering wheel powered. I love the screen in here. The screen is so beautiful. It's touch screen as well as controlled by the iDrive controller here. This specific BMW X5 comes equipped with the Harman Kardon sound system. So it has really, really nice vocals as well as bass and anything else that you may looking that you may be looking for. The gear shift lever is the same gear shift lever BMW has been using for a little while. Put your foot on the brake, hit the unlock button here and flick it back towards you for drive. Flick it up without pressing the unlock button for neutral and to go in reverse you have to hit the unlock button and push it up when you go in reverse your backup camera does come on which as well as your parking sensors does have trajectory This is your traction control button here. This is your sport mode and your comfort. So you can change driving mode. It changes everything from steering feel to suspension. And it does have the parking sensors as well as the camera. You can turn this camera on at any time to view what's in front of you. It's a beautiful feature. Very good. The button below that is going to be the downhill assist. And your iDrive controller will be located here, as well as your electronic parking brake and your auto hold. It does have a nice, beautifully leathery padded armrest here to open up. You just press these buttons here, it opens up two ways. I have my phone in here just charging here. And it does have a wireless charger. So you can put your phone in this little pocket for it to charge if that's what you want to do. All right, let's get out of the car. It has very nice adjustments on the seats as well as your two-person memory. This controls the thigh extender for us taller folks. Panoramic sunroof. It does have a nice panoramic sunroof. With most panoramic sunroofs, they only stop about halfway, but this one opens a very, very nice distance here, honestly. It's really big, it's really nice, it lets some nice sun into the cabin, it's very beautiful. Look at the color on this car, though. The color on this car is crazy. I'm sporting the door seals. This is the back seat here. Oh, it's very beautiful and roomy back here. Leather feels really good. Everything is very nice, leathery, padded. Nice cargo in the back of the seats here. As well as the back seat does have their own climate controls. And heated seats. So they can turn their, their AC or heat on, you know, as they want to or as they need to. Has cup holders in the door, nice storage down here, window controls, nice vents located here, panoramic roof looks very beautiful from the back seat. child locks on on the other door so I had to come out of this side. Very nice LED tail lights and it looks like that they got the car debadged so the X5 emblem is off. It's just 
BMW emblem back here. It's very beautiful, very nice and clean. Dual exhaust. And I'm gonna show you guys what it sounds like. From there, we will make our way to the trunk, to open the trunk. You just put your hand here. There's a button that you would push, and it opens two ways. To open the top, you push the button. To open the bottom, you pull that lever here, and it opens for you. You know, we're gonna clean this trunk, of course. It needs a little bit of cleaning. It's a beautiful trunk. Beautiful car. And to close the top, you just hit this button here. Make sure that's closed all the way. And then you hit the button here. And then we'll open the engine compartment for you guys to show you what that's looking like. Headlights are very beautiful. BMW HID high intensity discharge with the LED halo ring. Also comes with fog lights. And this is where the actual camera is for the front of the car, right here. So we're viewing, we're viewing everything from the cabin from this camera here. So to pop the hood, you just pull this lever here. I love how it has the M Sports door seals. Beautiful, very beautiful. Very beautiful. Twin turbo. This is BMW's twin turbo engine. I'm going to give it a rev from here and see what it sounds like. Very beautiful, very smooth sounding, it's nice, very, very nice SUV. Thank you guys for watching my review today. If you want to see any specific cars, please place it in the comments and I will try to get my hands on it as soon as possible. Thank you guys and have a great day.